My name is Barb Lofersweiler and I am the coordinator of the Digitization Lab for the University Libraries. We digitize for the special collections of the university and our primary purpose is to make them accessible in a digital way and in, in an online repository or uh, with a website interface that anybody can come to. One example of the kinds of things we do uh, in terms of archival documents is the Press Collection and the Croft Diary from the Western History Collections over in Monnet Hall. And they wanted us to digitize all of the letters, and, which are um, single or two-page folded documents, um, and digitize the diary. And they also did a kind of cool thing, which was they used all those images for a crowdsourced transcription project. The Digitization Lab really has two full-time staff members and all of the hands-on work is really done by the student employees. We have a lot of student employees during the school year and a fair number during the summer. They touch the archival documents, they turn the pages of the 16th century books, they do all the photography and all the scanning, um, color correction, um, cropping, straightening, adding metadata, all those kinds of things. We'll photograph typically about 400 pages per day. There are all sorts of other possibilities depending on resources, time, uh, people staffing, money of course for equipment. Some of the things that would be really exciting to do at some point include something called hyperspectral imaging which is um, there are a little those two things are a little bit different but the idea is taking not only a color photograph of something but taking many several or quite a few different photographs at different wavelengths and then seeing what you can learn from something by looking at these different wavelengths. 